Now, the Methodist Girls High School is organizing their 35th anniversary and 5th speech and prize giving day and 2nd homecoming. All of that is happening this weekend. We've got two of their old students with us, Vida Inchi and Salma Sakara. I hope I've said that right. Uh, of the school are here to tell us all about this upcoming program. Ladies, how nice to meet you both. Salma, did I get your name right? Yes, you did. Thank goodness for that. All right. Well, thank you so much for being here with us. Talk to us about uh, Methodist uh, Girls High School and this big weekend you have ahead of you. Okay. So the Methodist Girls High School was initially a mixed school. It was known as the Memphis State College in the year 1984. So in the year 1988, um, they were facing financial problems, administration, stuff. So the government had to absorb the school into the public system mm. and then now convert it into a girls' school. Right. So now we're having our 35th anniversary, fifth speech and prize giving day, and then second homecoming. And we want to celebrate a big time. So we are having a few activities going on in the school, which is on the 15th to 17th. There will be a lot going on. Mm, yeah. I can well imagine. Before we get into the details of the program, tell me, uh, Salma, about being a student of Methodist Girls High School. What was that experience like? It was a good experience. And um, the discipline I got from the school has made me who I am today. The school like, trains us to become independent and then benevolent people in the society. So, mm -hmm. yes, Methodist Girls High School, it's a good school. Mm -hmm. I would recommend that to any J junior high uh, student who mm -hmm. wants to pursue into secondary school, yes, and you're a female, mm -hmm. I'll tell you to go in for Methodist Girls High School. Apart yeah. from that, we do well. We mm -hmm. do very well with our academics. Yes, mm. Methodist Girl High School mm. made me who I am today. Mm. If it wasn't for the training I had there, trust me, I wouldn't have been able to finish with my um, tertiary education. So mm. Methodist Girls High School, all the best. Excellent. <laughs> all right, so, so any famous alumni, any well-known people we might recognize who went to your school? Um, Mickey Darling was um, in our school. When mm. the school was a mixed school, mm. Mickey Darling was there. And then um, we have Noella. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, Noella is very famous. Noella. <laughs> yes, that's wonderful. All right, so tell us about the weekend. What's coming up? Uh, what are the specific activities you've got lined up? Okay, so on the Friday morning, there will be a float. We'll go to the township with the brass band and everything. And then when we come back, we're having an eating competition. Oh, yes. right. Eating competition. Mm -hmm. After that, I bet you're winning that one. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <laughs> I am. <laughs> All right, what else is happening? And then um, it's a sport, uh, it's a house of sports competition, yes, together with the old students. Then in the evening, we'll be having our bonfire and then the jams, of course. Mm -hmm. Then on the Saturday, we have the main event, which is the anniversary and then speech and prize giving day our fundraising events, cadet display. Saturday evening will be a special dinner. We dine with the old students, teachers, and everybody. On the Sunday, we have our church service, Thanksgiving, and then departure. Wow, sounds like an exciting, very action-packed weekend. Mm -hmm. So I'll, uh, perhaps I'll give you the chance, Salma, to give your final message to all your alumni out okay, there. Okay, so we want all my courses to attend this program. Not only them, it shouldn't be limited to them only. Anyone who is interested in attending can come. You can come and see what Methodist Girls has turned into. You can come and have a look at the school. Maybe if you are a parent or a guardian, you want to know more about the school, you can come during this period, that's Friday, Saturday, Sunday, you are free to come into the school. Come and take a look around and see. But we're entreating all old students to kindly come come and support your alma mater come and know how the school has progressed from where you left it from and then we can see the way forward so that's what i'm so glad you both came in to get us all excited about your big weekend i wish you the very best of luck thank you thank you Megosa, everyone <laughs> all right now ghana starts their 2021 africa cup of nations qualifying campaign at home to south africa uh, and uh, that's happening in cape coast 
So we've been catching up, uh, speaking to a few people about uh, the excitement that is capturing uh, the city in the run-up to this big game.